Welcome back, Roxton fans. We're back on Onderon Saga. Hopefully my microphone is fixed. I'm screwing up settings. Anyways, doesn't matter. We're going into chapter 16 today. Thank you so much for all the love on the recent videos. We're, we're, we're going to get into it. It's an early morning stream. Good morning, good morning, happy weekend, whatever. Chapter 16, Berserker Gang. <clears throat> Jaka and his men follow the Harriers north. Soon they enter the realm of Hornheim. Few th southerners have ever visited this cold, unforgiving realm and survived. Even fewer have seen the city of Iceflow, where Clan Scotty resides. Resides. Greetings, Jaka. You must be the one they call the Lord of Lances. And you used to be Skylar the Wise, a bit pretentious if you ask me. I did not give myself that title, and I agree with your assessment. I imagine you are eager to learn why I have brought you here, Jocko. I'm hoping it's because you intend to give me and my army, gift me an army to assist my revenge. <laughs> a funny fellow. I am, in I am in possession of an ancient book. It is known as Val Valak's Tome, the Book of the Grim Reaper. Passed down from each head shaman to the next, this book is how I earned of your comrade's fate. Alex Tom, the name sure sounds ominous. My people have earned an unfortunate reputation of being witches. Some say we are an evil incarnate, the daughters of evil, sad falsity. We are quite benign. Our magic is not some unknowable evil from the West. So how does the magic book work? The tome allows me to ask it a question. It will answer me with a yes or no. There are limitations to its knowledge. It cannot divine the future, but it can divine the past. It can also tell me of events occurring in Onderon. Through an, a series of queries, I learned of Baudimon's death and your loss. I know what it is you seek, and that would be revenge. Against Mortimer, yes. So you want to help me kill a, thing? kill a king? Our people are presently living in a precarious situation, Southerner. We are in a unique position to help us out. You are in a unique position to help us out and receive our support. My granddaughter speaks truth. If you help us, we'll help you. It will be a fair and equitable exchange of benefits. If I refuse, I'm not a cruel person. You may stay <clears throat> a few days to rest. Then you must be on your way. All right, I'll bite. What do you want from me? The Icebreakers have a new Jarl. Tyranar, the Thunderwalker. Right now... His armies threaten Ice Flow's western borders. You need me to kill him? <laughs> Hilarious jest. You stand no chance. I have a simpler mission for you. I need you to assist me in defending my land. I plan to open peace negotiations with Clan Berserk. I would like your help. Peace talks? Why would you need my help? I've seen Helga's wear Harriers. Surely you can defend your borders, fly up, and negotiate without me. My clan is powerful, but it is also limited. We specialize in the dark arts, but lack diversity. Your army is well trained. Clan Berserk won't join hands against the Icebreakers if they think we're weak. In truth, we are the smallest of three Viking of the three Viking clans. We need outside assistance. I see. And if my soldiers die, it will be more convenient if yours do. We will pay for your services, services, food, lodging, gold, and weapons. The North is frigid, but you will be safe while you stay here. You can help me defend my land while preparing your revenge. If we succeed in allying with the Berserk, I will assist you. In what way? Where, will your Harriers be any use against Mortimer? Berserk and the Ice Breakers have long grown used to fighting my Helicorns. But the Southerners will not be nearly as ready as when we rain, rain hell from above. Alright, this seems like a fair proposal. But how do I know you won't backstab me? I'm willing to defend your borders, but if your Harriers leave at a crucial moment, you will hold plenty of leverage over my people during your stay. My granddaughter will join you. If you sense any deceit from me, her life will be in your hands. Yes, Grandmother. Not you, Helga. I speak of your sister, Sigrid. What? You would give my little sister to these southerners? Grandmother, I must protest this. Sigrid is the jewel of our clan. She is not some trophy to be... Quiet. Argue not with your clan leader. My word is law. G Grandmother. What in the divine's name was that? Are you a demon after all? What I am is powerful, and in dark times like these, you need strength. Perhaps you think you can be choosy with your allies. I express my doubt. You. Do you agree to my request? Your corps will fight in exchange for benefits. My granddaughter, Sigrid, will be 
your assur assurance of my sincerity, Jaka. Using your own progeny as a chip. Not sure I like your tactics, Skyla. Can I assume she will be able to guide my people around the region at least? She will. Then we have a deal. I have to assume your granddaughter means a lot to you. Don't try any funny business, or else. What was that? What was that? If you hurt one hair on Sigrid's head! Calm down. I have a younger sister, too. I won't hurt Sigrid. Skyla knows that. Telling me your threat is toothless weakens your position, Jaka. But I do admire your kindness. Before you leave, I have one request. Bring the light. Bring in the Lightbringer's heir. Hey, Londa, what do you want with her? She is the daughter of the previous king, Caithus. Can this old woman not pay her respects? Well, all right. Give me a sec second, but no sudden movements. How very protective of you. <sighs> Breathtaking. Just like Lady Iris. You speak my mother's name too casually, Voidborn. What business do you have with me? There's no need for hostility, young one. My clan has historically been your enemy. But must old hatred continue in perpetuity? Can we not set aside our differences? Perhaps. The Lightbringers and Scotty have their own way of doing things, but our existences are hardly at fundamental odds with each other. I have no love for that wretched bastard who killed your husband. Why not move past old grievances for the sake of a brighter future? Because I cannot imagine a Voidborn would relish the careless, the caress of a. Blah, 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 blah. Cannot imagine a Voidborn would relish the caress of light. How many people have you sacrificed to obtain such a frightful aura? I am the first woman of Scotty you've spoken to in person. You are. That aura you sense is my connection to the void. All Scotty and elders possess it. Darkness is everywhere, Lady Aylanda, but it is not evil. I find that hard to believe. Sailors drown at sea, but does that make the ocean evil? Creatures kill in the woodlands. Does that mean the forest? Does that make the forest evil? Furthermore, your father was a man who cast Onderon into ruin. Under his reign, the commoners suffered. The plague rampaged. If darkness is evil and light is good, how do you explain that? Would a righteous man allow such evil to spread under his watch? I had not given that matter much thought. Sometimes I forget about my father's actions. My apologies. I judge you prematurely, Skyla. You are too kind, Aylanda. I hope to open your eyes during your stay. My clan lives in isolation, but we are neither monsters nor wishes. Witches. We simply use rumors to protect our people from avaricious aver, 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 outsiders. I'm sure you can imagine the men who would kill to lay hands on our woman. I understand. Now I see why others refer to you as Skyla the Wise. We must speak more in the future. I'd like that. Farewell, daughter of Caithus. May the darkness shield you from your pursuers, and may the light illuminate your path to the future. That was an interesting discussion. Any thoughts? Hmm, I don't want to trust her. My father told me tales. He spoke of how Scotty shamans would eat mothers and babies. They'd butcher men and make meat pies out of them. My old, men, my old man used to tell me Demis did the same thing. Centaurs stomped in the, the skulls and, of humans in the pulp. Dragons cooked and served us to their young. <sighs> Maybe I was too young to understand what he meant. My father was trying to scare me into being a good girl. These Scotty witches don't seem all that bad then, huh? You're not magically attuned, but I am. She smells of shadow. I can't shake any of my lingering distrust of Ky Skyla's ways. You're a lightbringer. You probably just have an aversion to darkness. Like fire and water. Or fire and ice. Or fire in a forest. The damnable fire! It ruins everything! <laughs> you surely have a way with words. Um... I appreciate that. I feel like this game's been pretty damn serious at times, and then pretty damn silly in other, like, just moments. I think that was the perfect amount of, like, comic relief. And some of the more silly, weird shit with, um, like... I'm trying to think of what it was. Maybe it was, uh, Boogie. Nah, I don't even think it was Boogie, really, but... Anyways... It's neither here nor there. Jaka, you bastard, hold it right there. Pardon? Have I done something that offended you, woman? Blech. Shut your mouth, open your ears. Let me make one thing clear, and that would be... My grandmother has put my little sister in your care. I dare not speak out against her commands publicly, but if Sigrid does return to me and does not return to me in good health, I will make you suffer a fate most unspeakable. You're not giving me the best impression of Clan Scotty's hospitality right now. Male scum, I know the way your thoughts spin. You're all the same. Calm down, I won't hurt your little sister. I'm not that kind of guy. Like I said, I have a sister myself. I'm just as overprotective as you. Hmm. You stop glaring at me already? Your eyes are going to bore holes in my skull. 
Helga, where are you? Big sis, I finally found you. I was looking everywhere. Oh, hello there. I'm Sigrid. It's very nice to meet you. Hello, Sigrid. Well, aren't you a pleasant little girl? Are you two re really related? <laughs> Grandmother tells me I'll be in your guide. I'm kind of nervous, but also excited. I've never met Southerners before. I promise you, we won't. We don't bite. <laughs> You're funny. Oh, Gaul says people from the South are smelly and rude. I've yet to be proven wrong. You're the rude one. Bah, I'm going home. You better not forget what I told you, foreigner. Sigrid, you and I will talk later. Okay, bye-bye, big sis. Okay. Your sister sure is a friendly person. I know, right? My sister is the nicest person ever. I was being sarcastic. What's that mean? <laughs> Never mind, kid. Let's move on. What do you do for fun out here? I'm guessing you throw snowballs? Uh-huh. Snowball fights are a lot of fun, but I also like to read books. Really? What have you read recently? Miguel's intro to pyrokinetic engineering and warfare. Third edition. Updates by Sir Hubert of his house spear garden. Uh, you're serious? Mm-hmm. Why wouldn't I be? You're an interesting child. Thanks, and you're an interesting old man. <laughs> but I'm not even that old. <sighs> Never mind. Well, anyway, I'll see you later, Grandpa. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, my God. What the heck? Do I really look like an old man now? I wonder if Elanda has a mirror I could borrow. Okay, there's there's some more a little bit of light in the game because I feel like we haven't been having much of it. Well, I guess the last few car <laughs> chapters have been pretty dark after losing Baudimon. So that makes sense. After taking a few days to prepare, Jock and his men head north to earn their keep. The Berserker Mountains are treacherous, but Jock's men march through the snow. Sigrid guides them well. Soon they reach their destination. The Berserkers are near. Wow, we've gotten really lucky. It's only 10 below today. It's not often the weather is so warm and pleasant up north. Warm and pleasant, my foot. By the way, about the snow. Makes it hard to see. What if the enemy ambushes us? That's fine. The blizzard sometimes goes away from time to time. Also, I can hear people fighting ahead. You better get ready. You can hear in this blizzard? Maybe you Scottians really are snow witches. What? <laughs> Come and face me, little icebreaker poppies. I am half, half, half down the ravenous bear. My roar sunders the mountains. If there's anyone out there who can send me to my ancestors, oh, come grant me the death I crave. I said death. Okay, so are we going to be able to see any of this? We are. Oops. Okay, so we got a berserk. Warriors from Clan Berserk. It's kind of weird because Clan Berserk is called Clan Berserk, but then there's also just like the class of berserkers, you know? So, um, yeah. At least they look somewhat capable, you know? That's good. <laughs> oh, that's actually not good. <clears throat> so we gotta get to her pretty quickly. They're pretty well, uh, equipped as well. Battle axe, iron axe, steel axe, battle axe, silver blade shorts, or they'll duke it out here, but they sh ooh, this one, okay, th that one should be fine for a while. Oh, this is Halfdan, this is the guy we need to go uh, talk to, <laughs> he seeks an honorable death. Um... Okay, that's a pretty good skill, I guess. Ba -da -da, ba. Wait, why is this? Why is this green? Leviathan, Hal Halfdan, Half, Halfdan's, Halfdan's battle axe. It's got forty crit. Whoa, are we gonna recruit this guy? I feel like we might. I feel like we might just. Da, 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 da. <clears throat> Is there a boss somewhere? Somewhere around here, somewhere? Maybe? Okay. Let's see, who can we bring? I do want to use a freaking trainee, but I just think, you know, the further we go, the harder it's gonna be. Obviously. Um. I feel like Natalie is going to be the better one. But. Oh, she's magic based, though. It's so weird. Shoot, man, shoot. Ba, 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 
And we kind of want to use Asia, right? I think we get rid of Ariel for now. How in the world am I going to actually take someone out with her? Oh, okay, that's nice. And Sigrid, oh, Sigrid's level one. Her growths are going to be crazy, I already know it. But she's going to be a pain to level up, I'm going to guess. Ba -da -da -ba 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 -ba. Maybe I do want to bring... I might want to bring another mounted unit on this. Ariel might be good. Garam also might be good here. Okay, the snow's not restricting my movement, which is pretty nice. Park to villages from being destroyed. You cannot visit them, so keep them safe. The more of them you save, the bigger your reward will be at the end of the map. If you fail to protect three of the six villages, you will fail and get a game over. You must also ensure Haftan survives. Okay, seems simple enough. I've restored the power of Lulumina. You may use it once during this battle. Thank you, Master Sicarius. I'll use it carefully. Okay, that's right. I forgot I had this in her pocket. Okay, okay. It's about damn time. Okay. <clears throat> I didn't turn on the animation. Do I need to turn anybody's off at this point? I don't think I do. Might as well just keep them on. Dap, bap, dap, dap. Dang it. <laughs> Still gonna need another one. That's all right though, probably. First of all, we probably should just get a little bit of Torchin out of the way, right? So we can see a little bit more what's going on. <clears throat> you just missed a 90?! Thank you. Thank you for correcting your mistakes. Oh, I strength bows. Well, okay then. I don't know how that happened. What's this? Short bow. <laughs> So, don't want me to take flyers up there, that's for sure. That's um, clear to me, at least, I should say, maybe. Bop, 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 bop. I'm really um, impressed by Shom's uh, freaking. Um, you know, it, the whole three, four, five, the whole um sword performance last chapter that was pretty good. Didn't see it coming either. 
forgot all about it. I'm not, I'm not sure if I remembered he had it at all, really. Oh, he can't use the restore. What an idiot. Why am I sucking? And he needs a decently normal axe. Hand axe, maybe? I don't know, I guess. Bow, 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 bow. <sighs> I'm waiting. I'm waiting for what kind of kerfluffery is ha going to happen in this chapter because, first glance, I'm not too scared. But I know it's not that simple. It's never that simple, right? The weather may look bad, but don't worry, the bl 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 blizzard will break soon. Who's Ralph near? Why did we just destroy Ralph near? <laughs> Who is this? <laughs> Wait, go back. Go back. Who is Ralph near? Seeking to avenge his father. Is this Bjarki's kid? Oh. Talk to Barrett. Okay. Well. <laughs> All right. I <laughs> I could just restart, but we're close enough to where this is fine and right. <laughs> I can't believe we just destroyed freaking Balfnir or whatever. <clears throat> they just really threw that in there. Didn't even didn't even warn me about it. That's fine, I guess. <laughs> me, dude. I don't want another axe unit though. I was gonna say. Maybe this is the trainee that we use, but I've already got so many axe wielders. Maybe axe wielders are just the best, you know? Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> that was hilarious, actually. Oh, I forgot to get the frickin' restore from you. Wow, you're supposed to dodge that, man. Maybe it's just the uh, these enemies aren't that good, so you can freely kind of rush to the end, or rush to the villages, you know? I don't know. Oh, they're doing good work over here. Hey, that's nice. It's really nice of you right there. Hey, thank you for dodging that one. If we put it back on a uh, two or a uh, solo animations, does that mean the these guys don't show? Because this is actually going to be a lot of stuff. Oh, he's going right for half health then. No matter. Ah! Nice, he hit him. Ah! 
just absolutely smoked. Oh no. Oh no! Oh no. Oh my god, it doesn't end. Okay, half ten heals. Good, good, good guy. Smart guy. Okay. Wait, where are you going? What are you doing? You missed! Don't do that! Okay, you dodged it at least. Oh no, here we go. Oh. The blizzard's gone. That means no more snowflakes for our tongues. What? No more snowflakes for our tongues. Okay, so we've got a couple of powerful shamans here. One of them is a druid. And... We cannot quite take them out. But maybe if we do, like... Oop. <laughs> if we have a longbow, though, we can easily take one out. Is that cheating? Uh-huh. I think it's cheating. It knows I'm ch trying to cheat. <laughs> uh... That's fine. How am I how am I gonna get Rolf near? Do you have to come talk to me? How does this work? I can't I can't talk to you. Okay, I'm gonna guess he's gonna come talk to me, I guess. I don't I don't know. But maybe he'll just come and kill himself on me. Not sure. Not sure. Oh, okay. Butter da butter da butter da butter da butter da. Before I forget, let's do that. Dum, 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 dum. Holy axe! There must be some kind of terror chapter coming up. Faux show. Da 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 Rune is kinda badass. She just needs some better uh <clears throat> weapon level. If she had stabs, that'd be great. If she just wasn't an archer at all, that would be cool. <laughs> uh Don't crit me. I know it wouldn't matter, but... It's the principle of the thing, right? Okay, don't get in range of freaking Rolfnir. Rolfnir's scary, alright? Don't want to cross him. Oh, I forgot to do it again. Wait, now he can use the restore? He just couldn't use it because nobody... Oh, I'm so dumb. So dumb. Oh, well. Guess we'll go this way. 
Where are you going? Why are you not a talking to me? <laughs> Do I have to survive combat? Is that what it is? Or does he have to survive combat, rather? I talked to him with Sigrid. Nobody told me you have to talk to him with Sigrid. It says Barret. You lied to me. Whatever. Game. Whatever. Okay, we gotta get a little bit closer to you. Oh, I can support. <clears throat> Good job, Coulter. Way to get that 6 XP and really freaking earn it, dude. I guess okay what is the point of that why didn't you heal like you did last time or run away rather wow four percent huh? four percent maybe uh maybe I do turn off animations I don't know Especially on a map like this one, it just seems like uh, there's a lot of fodder going on. I thought I... Uh, they're really going for it, I guess. Wait, don't attack that guy. You better dodge it. Thank you. Careful, the snowstorm's about to pick up again. What does that mean? There he is. Whoa, wait. I know you. Scotty's breath. What's going on here? Why haven't we won the battle? There's no way the berserkers should should be able to last this long. Hmph. I see. Southern mercenaries. No doubt they're behind this. They seem familiar. One of the commanders just showed up. Be careful. All right, and we're right in range of Burka, the renowned shield maiden from Clan Icebreaker. Fat skill. Adept. Gain a consecutive attack. Speed percent. Okay, that's actually kind of high. That's scary. Uh, I don't think we're going to be able to steal that. Especially because... Do we even have 23 speed? No. Okay. So, we could just walk up and attack her. <clears throat> Although that would not do very well for us. Garam's not the best person to have down here if there's going to be more magic units, but... What am I gonna do, right? Okay. So... <laughs> you there! You look unfamiliar! Are you a friend or foe? Do you fight for the icebreakers? Yes, I am Ralfnir, son of Dormund! I'm here to prove my strength! Oh great, I'm Secret of Clan Scotty, nice to meet you. What did you say? Scotty Witch! Unholy fiend, birthed from the evil darkness of the Terra Scourge! Pull back your hood so I can gaze upon your monstrous visage. I want to see if the Scotty Witches are as ugly as the stories say. Gah! Oh no, she's cute. Are you all right? What manner of sorcery is this? Illusionist scum! You've made yourself look like a girl around my age! Oh, sorry, Ralphnir. I don't know how to create illusions. My sister only taught me dark, dark, ma dark magic and basic spellcraft. Dark magic! I knew it! You have bewitched me! Remove this curse of infatuation now, or I will be forced to end you, she-devil! Aren't you already going to kill me? That's besides the point. Don't you think you can talk? Don't think you can talk your way out of this? Seems to me like you're doing most of the talking. I, uh, I mean, I. 
You don't want to kill me, do you? This is a lot harder than the stories and the father used to tell me. All I wanted was to become a strong warrior like he was. What happened to your father? He was the Jarl of Clan Icebreaker. Jarl Dorman, the red blood collar. But then Tyranor challenged him. My father lost that challenge. Now Tyranor is a new Jarl. I'm sorry to hear he died, but at least he died with honor. Since anyone can challenge the Jarl, it was bound to happen. Exactly, which is why I'm going to become the strongest Viking in all of Hornheim. And when I do, I will challenge Tyranar to, Tyranar to home gang and avenge my father! If you seen revenge against Tyranar, then why not fight, why fight under his command? Well, maybe I'm dumb, but this army is run by Tyranar's younger brother, Tyr. I've been planning to start my revenge by killing Tyr first, and Tyranar himself. Once they're dead, I become the new Jarl, and I'll restore my father's bloodline. I've heard of Tyr. He's a scary man. I don't think you can beat him now. Oh, I know. Why not join our group? We'll help you get your revenge. I would never join another Viking clan. That would forever tarnish my honor. Good point. Oh, but I have another idea. My grandmother hired some mercenaries. Old man Jaka, the Lord of Lances. You can join his corps without having to pledge loyalty to another clan. That way, you'll start a still count as a member of the Iceberg clan. Hmm, the Lord of Lances. His title sounds prestigious. He must be a mountain of a man. I'll definitely join him then. And, uh... It'll be nice to get to know you better as well. Tee hee, same to you. That's funny. Ralphnir, alright. Level 7 journeyman. He needs to talk to Barrett. Why can't Barrett talk to him? And he's got monstrous strength growth. Pretty decent everything else. Strength and HP. <clears throat> as as you do. Who's going to get there first, Ralphnir or Christina? Probably Ralphnir. <laughs> Freaking Ralph. Wait. What? I don't understand. Why can only he talk to him? Silly. All right. I think I'm going to do. Oh, I didn't do it yet because I <laughs> rewound. And then hopefully the green units won't be on anymore. I I think I I hope I don't know. So does she eat all of this though? A bardish? She only got like 18 defense. Could just have her attack right here. Give her the axe. Or I could put Barry there, maybe. Take the silver bow, though. It's got 22 crit, which is kind of annoying. S hmm. Might as well have her do it, and then support. Jocka, let me take the front lines. You've fought in long enough. Huh? What are you talking about? Dottimon is gone. You are a new commander now. Start acting like it. You have to take care of yourself. Let me take over your duties. You can lead us from the rear. Hell no. I belong right here alongside the rest of you. Jaka, you're not used to being a leader, so let me educate you. This army can handle losing some soldiers. We'll bounce back from it. However, if you go down, it's over. Everyone relies on your survival. You can't afford to play hero. Dottimon was always the first to enter the fray. Exactly. And look where that got him. My cousin was brave, but foolish. Don't follow in his footsteps. I thought you admired him. I did, but admiring someone does not mean you should copy their every decision. Learn from his mistakes. Be smarter. I'll try my best, but I can't promise everything. Okay. I feel like having this crew right here will do well to counter that lady. We should be able to take her out, right? Holy axe. Definitely gonna tear a chapter soon. You know, if my gut tells me anything, there's gonna be more of a boss. <clears throat> more bosses showing up here, so I'm gonna go a little bit this way. Be a little bit smarter about it all, you know?
Okay. Oh, half done. There you go. Oh, half done. Careful. Who are you? And are you with Clan Scotty? Damned witches. Ah! I wonder how many times that can proc. Is it just every every attack, basically, it can? Oh. Ah! That would have uh, killed me. <clears throat> if it crit. That would have been really sad. Really stupid and sad and sucky. Run, health done! That's really slow. Wait. Where's the other one? Oh, he's way over there. Oh no. So much for the nice weather. Yep. Oh. oh okay. Jesus. Da 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 da. Doesn't double, huh? Barrett should kind of have an okay time here though and I'm thinking maybe we just do a little bit of this here Jaka, of course, does some good work. <laughs> oh, nice. And she doesn't double Jocko. It's pretty good. Ba -ba. No way she can do it, right? <laughs> uh, no, but Bjarki probably can. Or not Bjarki. Barrett. Or we just have Isabel do it. Yeah, I feel like, why not? You can do this. Yes. Perfect. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, next turn, talk to, talk to her. Holy sword. Hmm. Wonder what this is telling me. Oops. Did not read that. That's okay. We don't need to. Bum, bum, bum. Are terrors going to show up on this map? No way, right? No way that could happen. Oh, there's more. Sorry, I'm, I'm sorry for speeding. Um, yeah, uh, so, Sword Reaver and Battle Axe. Oh, that's right, they spawn behind us, actually. I gotta watch out for that. Crap. I might have just moved what's-his-name right into it, in fact. Nice. For you to defeat a true Hornheim shield maiden, you must be very strong. You have my respect. Shield maiden. <laughs> All right, T. Defense is what we need. It's actually a little bit light on defense, believe it or not. <clears throat> not really much we can do other than rescue him. Um, but looks like they're not really too close, so should be okay. And uh, 
I can heal instead. I think I'm gonna heal that guy. Get you back over here. Coulter, I don't know if I want to waste the support on her. I don't think so. Where are you going? Oh. That's a lot of damage. Why did that hit me? <laughs> Careful, Havdan! Oh. He's actually fast. Ouch! Oh, I forgot you can S rank multiple weapons in this game. Why are you healing? Okay, good job. But you should probably be up there with Haftan. Blizzard's letting up. Bye-bye, Snowflakes. Oh, God. Okay, we need somebody over here with, uh... What's her name? Speed would be nice. Okay. Strength? <laughs> Why? Alright. Oh, he's got such little move. I forgot. Okay, so we need to get moving. I wish I had another healer. <laughs> oh, hello there. Should have one, two, three, four, five. It's not good. Uh, should have done this earlier. Should be okay. Except that's kind of scary. I think she might eat me up right there. But, gotta do it. This longbow? Okay. It's gonna be tricky. And we need you to torch. This guy's got to be getting some enemies by him soon, right? I mean, unless it's like a, gr a grid or something where you can't, it, nothing happens until you cross a certain line. I don't know. I doubt it, though. Okay. Okay. 51 HP, that's it. Nothing else. Come on. Go half then. No! 
Half dead! Oh god, no. Crit him. Wait. At least she lives. And at least she doubles him. But, whoa. That's scary. And that's actually kind of scary, too. And that's a little bit scary, actually, as well. <laughs> Everything's a little bit scary right now. Because of how ah! <laughs> Ralph near no! Oh, come on. I want to at least see the conversation. I really don't think I was going to use Ralph near though. So... Sorry, <laughs> I think I'm going to keep going without Ralph near. He didn't last very long, did he? Come on, Halfdan. Oh god. Hey, nice! Oh, here we go. The blizzard has stopped momentarily. Let's push forward while we can. Oh, Jesus. That's weird. Okay. Honestly, this guy's probably actually the most scary. No crit. Whatever, Coulter. Whatever, man. Ugh, oh, come on, Zacarias. I gotta take him out. We got a flyer. We got flyers abound. Jahira coming in clutch. I need another flyer, maybe. Okay, I'm sort of thinking I can use the um, the thing to heal everybody. I don't know yet. Because this is sort of looking poorly. You know what I mean? Might just do it. Might just do that. And this dude's giving him trouble up here, and he's out of healing items, though. He's kind of looking like Brandon a little bit. I wonder if that's where part of his sprite's from. Probably. Half done. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, so I'm thinking I'm gonna use the staff. Uh, Runa probably can just come up here and not quite do that. I don't know. Frickin' uh Frickin' what's his name? I can't believe we lost frickin' Rolf near. <laughs> Didn't even last a minute. How we still have Christina, I don't know. You got it! Is she gonna stop at level 10? Probably. Yes. <clears throat> Is she gonna change classes now or wait till the next chapter? It'd be really cool if it would be like right now, but it won't be probably. Yeah. Ba -da -ba -da -na, ba -ba -na. Think we just have Barry move up. Belly. Belly. Uh, 37. No, uh, she'll live. <laughs> Runa gets to level up. And it's another magic y one. Nice. Oh man, Jaka. It's pretty sick animation. Pretty sick. Heals the green units too, right? I think it does. Nice. You're dunions, boy. You're dunions. Now you're extra dunions. You're dunions for dinner. Sorry. I don't know what's happening. This is what happens when I stay here for an hour and playing Fire Emblem. Just weird shit. Just starts Why? I wasn't supposed to hit me. Ugh. Don't worry, the rest of them are gonna miss though, so it's gonna be fine. Uh, except for the hero, actually. Shit. Shit! Are you. Come on. The general hand axe animation is always pretty. It's always been pretty funny. It's just weird. Hand axes don't make any sense in general, but, you know. Speed and defense! Oh my! Wow. Wowza. Oh god. It's scary. Very scary. Very scary. I really hope this guy doesn't do enough damage. But he's probably going to. Oh no! Wow. Thank you, Coulter. For being uh, kind of badass. You know, I early promoted you, and I didn't think you were going to be very good for combat. Proving me wrong. Proving me wrong. Screw you! Are you kidding me, Afton? Get off the freaking. Get him off the mountain over there. Why is his name Haftan? 
Are you kidding me, dude? <laughs> Alright, now what? The air is getting colder. Blizzard's returning soon. Uh, oh! Ugh. Oh, shit. That's actually bad. Da, 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 da. He's like the worst unit to have down there. If we give y Runa like a freaking... Seven more turns. If we if we can just keep her alive, it'd be fine. I'm getting him out of there. We're going to move right there, and she'll be okay, right? Especially, especially if she crits everybody. All right, C rank is pretty good. They might just all go for him, but maybe not. I don't know. Okay, okay. <clears throat> I'm guessing someone's coming up here soon, and we ought to visit these if we can. Although, I don't think we can. Might as well try with Victoria before the onslaught, because I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure it's coming. Okay, perfect. So I can do this. Oh, he can't kill him. Damn it. So I have to hope for a crit, I guess. Oh no, I don't. Dumb. We got it, we got it. And... Heal up you. Uh, it's all for show, right? It's all for show. Oh, yes. What a good level up you had, Zacharias. What a good level up. What a good little level up guy. As weird as it is, the middle of the map is like the safest. These things are scary, but... Um, hopefully that just holds true, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? But we gotta get going up here. Uh, also, <laughs> this is a little bit scary. Our healer's right next to all of this nonsense here. Is this a forest? It is. And so is this. So I think we take out the... I think we wish we could take out that guy, and then... Actually, I mean, that's better. Still doesn't kill him, but at least we can heal you. So now you won't die. And what kind of units or weapons do we have? Halberd, steel blade, so a sword. Half Dan might die here. Very nice, little net. Very nice, little net. Uh, didn't go for my unit, but that's okay. Good dodging. Yes. Fall to my sword. Fall to my axe. He's pretty fast. Okay, that's good. You must fall to my sword. 
general sword. The funniest looking sword in the game. I mean, not really funniest, but... Ah! Careful, half done. Oh, good job, half done. Careful, half done. Oh, good job, half done. Oh, no. Careful. Guy. Oh, no, this is bad. Oh, no. Oh, no. Garum. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, no. Garum. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. He's defeated them all. We don't need Runa. Oh, have that move off of that space. Thank you. Thank you. Oh no, here we go again. The fog is getting thicker. Yes, this is actually scary. Ah, oh, god damn it. God damn it. Damn you. Damn you, Haftan. Sorry. Look, I said sorry. You're supposed to believe me. Goodbye. Remember when we did that to freaking what's his name? That was hilarious. Freaking Ralph Near. I wish I could use Ralph Near. I got too many good axe units though. It's not my fault. It's a little bit my fault, I guess. For being biased to axes, maybe. But I don't know. No one told me the rules. What rules? Idiot. I don't know. Now you're talking to yourself? I mean, I guess I've really been talking to myself this whole time. If you think about it, it's the sad truth. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> okay, so I think what we're gonna do is um, this. We're gonna get a crit. Just like that. See how well I know the game? And then... I think we're just, uh, we really need to get rid of this freaking idiot guy right here. But half Dan can take another hit so we can get rid of these fools first. Um, and this is a whole other, th this is a whole other level of the flockery. If we lose this guy, it's not a big deal, but obviously I want to try to keep as much as we can, right? How much do these guys do to me? A lot. So, maybe I... <clears throat> do I have a support over here? No. Why didn't I play my supports? I don't know. Idiot. If I torch, it might not reach, but it's worth a shot. It does not reach. So, assuming that there's going to be archers over here. I'm just going to go here. I have to visit something over here. Because it's probably worth it, and it definitely does look worth it. I just have no money. And I need more physics, for sure. All these tomes would be nice. Wait, that's effective against dragons? Okay. Well, I can't afford anything there. Maybe, maybe I can afford something here. Nope. Okay. Well, that <clears throat> that kind of fixes things for me. Battle axe, battle axe, Yorman can... Um, I gotta... The sniper is actually scary, so... I'm gonna take out the sniper. Okay, 
Maybe the steel bow. It's a lot of damage. Bam! Bam, 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 bam. So all that's left is over here. We should be able to finish off the other guy next turn, hopefully. I just want to see a little bit over here, I guess. Because I don't think anything spawned, but could be wrong. Nope, it's just this guy still, and I should have probably healed. But that's okay, he's gonna live. Everyone's gonna be fine. But we will heal you. Gyrum! Oh, thank you for missing. It would have been sad if that hit me. Oh, very sad indeed. Karius' animation is a little bit slow. Don't get me wrong, it is sick, but it is slow. Probably should just turn him off at this point in the game. Half dead, no! Finally. Okay, so, feeling better about this, and we're feeling good about that miss and this crit. No, no crits, no crits. I was, I was just playing with you, just messing around. Hee hee ha ha. Oh, that's a nice dodge. Can we get an assassination? Do we have that? I'm not sure we do. Nice. Nice crit. Assassin crit is always sick. I don't care what you say. Okay, I don't care what you say. That's why. That's 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 that. Nice. Uh, what? Oh, he definitely would have died here. If all of those hit him. Jormund gone. All right. Nice. Coulter, you're getting you're getting a promotion. I don't know what to, but you're getting promoted. Okay. Oh. <laughs> She's got miracle, but he's going to double me. He doesn't double me. Wait, where did he come from? Did I just totally walk away from him? I might have. Cuz I'm colorblind and stupid. I might have just totally walked away. Oh god. Alright. I think the snowstorm is going to let up soon, but it will be back. Oh no. Hmm. Hear sounds of battle from the north. The stench does not come from the land berserk. Foreign re foreigner reinforcements? To think the berserkers would stoop so low. My brother will break clan berserk spirit until they learn humility. Bringing in outsiders to our war is unforgivable. Honorless bastards! Come, Fenri Fenri's... Welcome, let's uh, hunt some southern bastards together. Woof woof. <laughs> that looks to be their leader. Everyone, take him down. Kill Tyr to end the map. Oh. But I'm 9 out of 10 turns. What's going on here? Was it all just a ruse? Or are you saying... Uh... Are you saying that I can survive or I can go kill him? And that ends the chapter. See, I could maybe have killed him with what's his face. No, I couldn't. I don't think he has enough might. Alas, it's unfortunate. Okay, I don't know where this guy came from, but he needs to go away.
Yes, you are done. And cigarette gets another level. Why accent? I don't know. Get defense and HP, please. Wait, did we look at her growths? I don't think we did. 20% HP. Okay, I can't use I can't use this unit. I can't. She's gonna get one shot by everything, but wait. Okay, if HP is above 50%, lethal hits reduced to one, so. Uh, uh, eh. They can sp summon spirits to attack. What? Wait, I can talk to Halfdan. We must talk to Halfdan. Oh, he has no canto. Oh, bollocks. Ah. Ugh. Stupid. You're done. What is it? it? It's the half your resistance or something to the attack? It's crazy. Or is it your full resistance? That's an insane skill. Add units resistance to damage. So it just does an extra 22 damage. That's insane. And it's a 22% chance of that happening. We're gonna crit. Yes. We don't need to use the uh, the uh, stiletto or whatever. Victoria hasn't seen any combat yet. Here we go. Good job. For experience. Yes. Okay. Can I have physic? She doesn't. <laughs> I don't even think it's worth it or useful enough to be worth that. I don't know what I'm doing now. I think I'm just gonna wait around and, and if uh, I could win the chapter, but oh, they're gonna kill that. They're gonna kill them. Easy. This is last turn already? Oh, wait. What? The blizzard has stopped momentarily. Let's push forward while we can. Okay, last turn. Excuse me, big person down here. I'm with Clan Scotty. My grandmother Skyla sent some mercenaries to help. Oh, your grandmother. You must be little Sigrid. Last I saw you were only this high. Take off your hood for me. Let me see your face. Um, do not fear. Skyla and I go back decades. I am Haftan, Ravana's bear of Klan Berserk. Oh, so your uncle Haftan. So Sister Helga talks about you. In that case, one second. Am I as pretty as you remember? <laughs> well, the last time I saw you, you were only a babe. Pretty is not the word I'd use back then. Huh? Why not? Babies can be pretty. How about we come back to that topper topic never, hmm? So, you've come to help me retaliate against my foes, but what is that dusty old book in your hands? Why did your grandmother send a child into battle? I'm not supposed to be fighting all that much. That's what the Southerners mercenaries... <laughs> Grandma has old man Chaka working for her now. Hmm, I was planning to attend your sister Helga's 25th birthday soon. How about you take this tome I had prepared for her and use it today? It's a good tome that will keep you alive, even when many foes attack. Ah, oh, Nosferatu! A brand new magic tome for me. Thanks, Uncle Halfdan. You're the best uncle ever. Mahaha. <laughs> such a polite kid. You remind me of Skyla at your age. Hmm. I had such a crush on her when we were growing up together. Gasp! You wanted to crush my grandma, but why? How about we focus on the battle for now, Sigrid? Okay. Oh my god. 
That's funny. She can't use it! What? <laughs> That's uh, funny. Okay, so basically you're guaranteed to lose one village unless you unless you know this is happening right here. So that's kind of lame because I don't think there's any way I'm going to be able to kill kill him. I want that master seal, but I had no way to know. Best I can do is get Jaka to take some enemy phase, but even then is like, but why? Oh, fire is super effective against him. Versus axes and armor. Might as well move everyone down, I guess. In case, in case the game is like not telling me the truth, that I have to kill him, and this isn't the last turn. You know what I mean? Oh my god! I didn't even think he was in range. I'm sorry. This has been a theme throughout this playthrough, and I'm sorry. This game is just so long. I'm not gonna reset the whole entire chapter because I got fucking crit all right especially on what might very well be the last turn and I'm just I just have to wait because it might just end right here I don't know and in that case I would have just hit wait and been done but the dialogue was a little bit unclear do I have to kill him to end it or does it just end up after 10 turns? Because, I mean, I would assume I would kill him and end it. Or the time thing would be useless. Okay, see rank and swords. That's where we want them to be. No one escapes once I have them in my sights. I guess. Nice. I sense a terrible snowstorm quick coming. We need to finish this quickly. Okay. <clears throat> it says last turn. I would assume that means that was the last turn, no? That's all I'm saying. Like, why? Why? I don't get it. So now I'm kind of fucked. <laughs> um, you need to just run. Does he outspeed me? He definitely does. He doesn't outspeed uh, Runa, but his crit is insane, so. He's probably just gonna go after green units. And that's fine, I guess. Uh, this is annoying. If it's going to say, you know, if it's going to say, kill him to end the map, take away the timer. Why do we have a timer? I get it if it's there up until that, or if it's last turn, and then, uh, you know, somebody else arrives or whatever. I don't know. But it, I just felt 
That was unnecessarily misleading. I don't know. Maybe that's just me being salty. <laughs> um, but yeah. <clears throat> And then I'm sure if I don't kill him fast enough, there's going to be a huge re, uh, reinforcement wave that is going to end my run. So you know, yeah, I just don't really know what to do here, to be honest. 32. It's going to eat through you. You need to run and hide. Ba, ba, da, ba. This guy got an axe? No. I feel like I gotta. I feel like I gotta pull back and just kind of try to tank with Jaka, which isn't great. Ten. This guy's gonna do a shit ton to me. Thirty-three. She can stand here and tank pretty easily. I think maybe we... Maybe we javelin here. And steel lance here. Uh, that does put what's-her-name in the range. She's not going to get doubled, though. Okay. That's a weird move for him. Ah, that's a lot of damage right there. An axe would have been a... Well, no, a sword would have been a better choice. That was dumb. Hopefully the icebreakers can do something here. Or they'll just miss a bunch. Uh. <clears throat> Come on. Do something. No. Oh, no. This is bad. We're as good as blind in this blasted blizzard. Actually, that's true. And that's really, actually, really bad. You can attack. You can attack me here. Which one is better? Silver Blade Killing Edge might be better to save. Okay, so this guy's still in range. Oh, barely not in range to attack me. 
But at what range does he go for the, uh, the village? I think we do this. Okay, kind of expected one of those to miss. I think we move Barrett over here. <gasps> and maybe Runa can do something to him. Then heal up Isabel. So he will, he's going to double Isabel. And it's gonna do. Wait, he doesn't miss? He just doesn't miss. I guess. <laughs> okay, he doesn't miss. <clears throat> He's got either 32 or 38 attack. And that's going to be 18 times 2 with no crit. Or 12 times 2 with a shit ton of crit. 65. I wonder how much I avoid. This guy's got 28 crit. He's still got... So I had dodged 29 crit. That's not bad. But it's still not what we're looking for. You know? You know what I mean? We just gotta sacrifice the ice bringers. Or the berserkers. That's good. That's actually huge. What? <laughs> he doesn't double Jaka. So we could do 32. He could do 14 times 3, which won't kill me. But if this guy hits me, it will fuck me up pretty good. <clears throat> but chances of that are hitting me are not very good. So I think we're going to throw Jaka out here. You're going to come over here. Okay, see, that's good. Okay, that's not good. I mean, I guess that's good. I just hope no one else can reach her. Okay. Okay, that's that's not good. But it missed. So that's actually fine? Maybe? Okay, because now... Because now we got... Victoria up in the ring and we have Barrett which admittedly she doesn't do much to her but oh gosh <laughs> okay no hold up oh no that mountain is so freaking clutch for him can we talk to him? I don't know why I would want to do that right now, though. We could box him in. But we need someone to get onto that mountain, which we can't do. We just barely can't do it. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I don't know. 
if I one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, it's not gonna be good enough either. We don't have any warps or rescues, right? I don't think we do. Oh man, so close to being able to cheese. But of course, we still might be able to do it with some crits and some lucky hits because without it, I mean, I just don't know. I just don't know. So first of all, let's let's get rid of this guy somehow. I think it's going to have to be uh, Garam here. So his healing is done. He has no more healing. Oh, would have been great if that, we could have stopped it earlier. But she can reach him. Do you have any supports, Jaka? That's really kind of scary. It's all very scary. I think, honestly, my first move is this. First move, like so, does that help Jaka much? Maybe, but the crit is so scarily high. I can support Jahira. How are you holding up, Scaly? I could ask you the same squ Uh, I think I've already read this. Yeah, I read that. Okay, raises his damage. A little bit of crit mitigation. Not exactly what we're looking for. Wait! I'm so dumb. First of all, we have a weapon just for this. Or not a weapon just for this, an item just for this, right? This thing. Yes. Oh, uh, do I take more damage or more crit? Or more hit, I mean. Oh god. I don't know. I'm gonna send it for more damage. <laughs> you chose wrong. Okay. Okay. Mm, more crit or more hit? For the one shot. I think we gotta go for this. Okay. Okay, that was scary. He's scary. God, you are strong. Someone must warn Tyranar. Oh. Definitely panicked there a little bit. Supports helped big time. And that's a great level up for you, Victoria. Thank you so much. Master Seal, we could use that. We can definitely use that. Great job, everyone. The rest of the icebreakers are retreating. And we saved all the villages. You there, boy. Who are you to come to my rescue? I do not believe we've met. I'm Jaka, leader of the Mercenary Corps. I come here on behalf of Skyla from Scotty. Ah, so Scarly sent Skyla sent you. I see. I am half done. Clan Berserk's leader. Some call me the Ravenous Bear. You can you came just in time to save my clan. Yeah, and I didn't expect to stumble into the middle of a battle. Why are the icebreakers attacking? Ha <laughs> ha Why would they? Why would they not? They are Vikings. War is honorable. There's no better feeling than swinging axes into skulls. Also, that Tyranar is a battle maniac who hungers for power. He's even crazier than me. Seems the icebreakers have set their sights on Clan Berserk. Can you resist our invasion? I'm the strongest member of my clan, but compared to Tyranar, I am humble. 
The icebreakers will win eventually. Their strength is too formidable. They have three times the numbers we do and five times the elite warriors. Skyla sent me to parlay with you. She wants she wants to sign a treaty. Scotty is the weakest of the three clans, but combined with yours, hmm, I would have not I would not have considered such an offer only a decade ago. But the times have changed. The outbreak took out half our men. Now our people are unprepared for a war with Tyranar. Outbreak? You're referring to the plague that ravaged Onderon? I thought it didn't make, make make its way up here to Hornheim. No, boy. I mean the outbreak of terrors. Thousands of them came from nowhere. They appeared ten years ago and spent half a decade clawing at our doors. We finally cleaned them out two years ago, but the damage was already done. Before, we could have held back Tyranar with ease, but things are different now. So you'll consider my offer. You're working for Skyla, yes? So you can't speak on Scotty's behalf. She's hired us to help guard her borders. We're mercenaries. Can't make a decision of this importance so easily. Especially not with a random hired mercenary leader. Tell you what, boy. I'll go back to, with you to see Skyla. It's been a while since I laid eyes on her figure. This will be a treat. Uh, her figure? I mean, that's what you're into. <laughs> I've known that woman since we were children. In her prime, her beauty, beauty could have brought nations to ruin. When I look at her, I still see her soft contours. Her large... I'll lead you back to Skyla. Just stop talking, please. <laughs> Here are your rewards for saving the villages. Holy Lance! Oops. White gem. Very good. Dragon shield. Very good. Chaka gets plus 4 HP for saving everyone. Nice. That's pretty cool incentive. A few days before, in the capital city of Mothrak, the same time as King Mortimer takes the throne. <gasps> All the commoners. Is it true? Did King Randall finally kill the barbarians? This must be the case, but he sure took his damn time. Look at our city. It's in ruins. We're not safe any here, here anymore. <clears throat> Daddy, can we leave now? This place is scary. I think we may just do that. King Randall is worth th worse than his father. He doesn't care about his people in the slightest. Haven't you heard? Randall was killed by Baudimon. I hear he's the new king. Really? That makes sense. Baudimon must have cleaned up his brother's mess. I saw the prince riding through the city in the with an army of legend. He swept aside Randall's paltry forces as if they were wheat. I've no doubt he beheaded that bastard of a first prince. You said Baudimon defeated Randall? I heard it was Sir Alexander. He charged in there with the Knights of Speargarden and cleared the city. Baudimon only took care of the bandits directly in his path. I say Sir Alexander was more noble. Hmm, a good point. I wouldn't mind if Sir Alexander became king. He's an incredible incredible military commander, a true man worth admiring. Let him kill Thorgrim's useless brat. It's time for House Steel to vanish. Careful, Edwin. If Randall is still king. Randall is still king. Blech. You don't want him to hear your words. That would mean a death sentence. Ah, I'll speak as I, as I please. I'm old. I've only a few le years left anyway. Let the elderly speak in your place. What will he do? Kill me sooner? Hey. Hmm. Look up to the north. A retinue of steel knights. Who's that in the front? Citizens of Mothrak, I must offer my deepest apologies. I am Prince Mortimer, third in line to ru rule House Steel. Another House Steel failed at lineage? Sawed off, you fiend. My kids are dead because of you. Torched in Mothrak's flames. Down with Prince Mortimer. My inn is in a pile of ashes, and it's all your fault. I love it when you speak truth to power, Jenny. That's when you're at your most attractive. What the? Quiet, Lester. I'm trying to level up my speech skills. I only get credit points if people hear my voice. Huh, <laughs> you and your pyramid schemes, babe. Love you lots. What? My fellow Onderonians. Onderonians. And Onderonians. I know Thorgrim was a terrible man. I saw his evil from a young age. I lived with it my entire life. Because of him, my mother died at the start of the rebellion. I also know that Randall would only bring ruin to Onderon. But what could I do? I was only the youngest of my siblings. Three days ago, my battle, my brothers battled one another for the right to rule Onderon. Their greed allowed raiders to burn our glorious city to the ground. Mothrock. Randall succeeded in killing Baudimon, but Baudimon struck him with poison. <clears throat> Randall succumbed to his injuries, and now only I remain to pick up the pieces. And so I shall. 
I refuse to be a mad tyrant like Thorgrim and my brothers. I will treat the people with respect and care. I will uplift you all. To start, I'll immediately hand out rations to, displace the, to the displaced and hungry. I will establish or, or, orphanages for any children who have lost their parents. I shall take gold from the treasury to rebuild this great city for all of you. Till the day I die, no citizen will go to bed hungry or cold. This I promise. I will start no wars. I will guide you to a future of equality for all. Now, what say you? King Mortimer is righteous. He will deliver us from evil. I'll hail our new king. Down with Randall and Bautimon. Hey, oh, King Mortimer. Hey, oh, King Mortimer. <laughs> not too easy. Thank you, everyone. I will not let you down. A new era is upon us. An excellent speech, my liege. Is this your real body? Coming here in person would put me in great danger. Who knows how the peasants might react when I appeared. I'm hurt. You didn't mention me in your speech at all. Did I not ass assist your rise in an, in an indispensable manner? The better question is, do you even care what Mothrock peasants think of you? In general? Of course not. But in the abstract? Yes. Reputation is power, my king. Take care to learn this truth. Don't confuse me with Randall. Giving speeches is my forte. Truly praiseworthy. Shall we go now? I'm almost done with my speech to the nobles. Let's meet up with my main body next. I'm yours to command. Woo-wee! Alright, that was a tough chapter. Uh, mostly the, the curveball at the end, I guess. But, come out unscathed. Sorry for dodging the dumb crits and my dumb placement. I just... <sighs> I feel like you know how I feel about it by now, you know? It's like, if I were to replay the game for an hour... It's because I've truly been defeated. <laughs> And not misplays like that, because that's usually what happens. You know, I just put someone in a dumb place, and yeah. Oh well. Sometimes you gotta pay pay for those mistakes, but in this case, no. Maybe someday will there be a they'll there will be an Iron Man. You know. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.